Hello, I am Michael Kirichenko. You are watching Skyway News, where we report on the developments and implementation of breakthrough transport technologies. From today's issue, you will learn about the tests of the track structure in Skyway Eco Techno Park, about the innovative development of our company, about the process of creating a rolling stock, and a new acquisition of the production site. And now about all this in more detail. Operation of string rail track structures on the territory of Skyway Eco Techno Park goes on in test modes that are set out by periodic static tests. The static tests of light coil tubing second track structure were conducted in Marina Gorka this week. It should be made clear here that these are tests of structures by a static load, the value and direction of which are not changed during their execution. Subsequently, the technical condition and operational reliability of the most critical structure will be assessed through a comprehensive analysis of the data obtained. To improve the efficiency of working with 3D Experience product life management tools, together with colleagues from Dassault System and IGA Technologies, expert groups were created to work out operative cases, analytics and search for solutions. This format of work has helped to share experience, to understand some of the specifics and to make constructive proposals improving the system. Testing of 3D Experience R2019X platform revealed the emergence of new useful tools that will be in demand by many departments after the transition to the new version planned in August 2019. In order to provide information security for the functioning of Skyway String Rail Transport Complex, the company's employees develop hardware and software products for automatic detection of forgotten or abandoned things, packages, bags, suitcases, in particular at the stations and terminals which passed a successful test last week. The use of this system will improve safety of functioning for both Skyway Innovative Transport and Infrastructure Complexes as a whole and any other transport and infrastructure objects, for example, airports and railway terminals. Full-scale tests of the energy-absorbing deformable safety braking device of the high-speed unibus prototype, capable of absorbing the bulk of the shock load during emergency braking, were carried out on the basis of the Belarusian Research Institute of Construction. The results are consistent with previous theoretical studies and calculations. They fully confirm the correctness of the chosen method of modeling and assessment of the structural design of the unit. Startup and commissioning work on modernized systems of the vehicle in terms of refitting in accordance with the Uniform Standard of Transport Safety for Passengers is being conducted at Skyway Eco Techno Park in the framework of endurance tests with Unibus U4-210. An updated algorithm of cooling system for the operation of Unicond for transporting containers including C1s has been worked out. Its control logic has a number of features and differences from the previous ones. First of all, it is the presence of three cooling circuits and, accordingly, a number of actuators. In addition, the system has a greater number of heat exchanges of cooled electrical equipment, which is due to design specifics of the vehicle while operating it under tropical conditions. It should be also noted that an important aspect in the control of the cooling system is the issue of failure detection of its elements. As during the movement of the vehicle, the performance of such a key system as the traction electric drive one depends largely on the removal of heat. Therefore, the developed algorithm also presents possible ways to detect failures of main elements in the cooling system in accordance with the executed DFMEA analysis. For reference, design failure mode and effects analysis is a technique that aims to improve a design by analyzing potential design nonconformities with a quantitative analysis of consequences and causes of nonconformities. Last week, we began the final stage of assembly works and preparation for demonstration of the simplest and lightest model at the moment. 
at EcoFest 2019, it will be possible not only to examine directly the product and test the convenience of design in accordance with its functioning, but also to obtain full information about the purpose, tasks and place of operation. The new acquisition of the industrial facility has become an effective device for presetting and tool measurement, Hamer Microset, that optimizes manufacturing improves the reliability of the technological process by increasing cutting tool life, improving the quality of processed parts, reducing setup time and decreasing downtime of the equipment. In the absence of such a device at the production facility, adjustment and measurement of a tool occurs directly on the machine and, if available, adjustment can be done in parallel during operation of the machine. The device is equipped with two cameras with illumination and image processing system Microvision UNO, which allows seeing cutting edges of a tool in real time in two projections. Availability of motorized micrometric adjustment along the C-axis and autofocusing with a rotary encoder allows doing measurement of complex tools in semi-automatic mode. Everything is going on according to plan at Skyway construction sites both in the United Arab Emirates and Belarus, so today we have spared time to smaller but no less interesting news, such as our traditional brief report on the progress in the development of Skyway technology over the past week. Follow the updates of the official Skyway website. Sign up to Skyway YouTube channel. Support our project. After all, success is not far off with such a team. Build Skyway. Save the planet.